everybody, it's Christina, and today I have a new video for you, and I know I, s I said I was going to start my fall videos this week, but unfortunately, I'm kind of sick right now, and I don't know if you guys can hear it. I'm trying my best to, like, not make my voice sound like I'm dying, because I am literally dying of convention flu right now. Not even going to lie, I'm dying of convention flu. I've been putting off filming all week because... My voice has just been off about it and I just haven't been feeling up to it. I'm still not 100% but I'm feeling a little bit better today. So today is going to be my filming day. Bear with me. If my voice cracks, like splits, or sounds like I'm dying of disease, it's because I'm sick. And I'm going to apologize ahead of time. I hope it's not too distracting. So if you're new to my channel, then hi, welcome. My name's Christina and I do a whole bunch of lifestyle stuff, kind of like a beauty guru, but the only difference is I'm also an extreme nerd. So welcome to this nerd cycle of like, a welcome, com what? So if you want to join in on the fun, you can also hit that little subscribe button down below, and then you can also give this video a thumbs up because it helps out around here, and I know you guys enjoy this stuff and it helps me create better content for you, so just do. So if you guys didn't know, last Saturday I actually filmed a vlog and I actually went to Fan Expo 2015 in Toronto and I was so excited to go and that's also kind of why I'm dying of convention flu, like I'm sick from the convention. <laughs> Sacrifices had to be made and my health was one of them. If you guys, so if you guys want to, you can also check out that vlog, I'll have it linked down here below, and I think I'll put like a little snippet like right here or something like around here so you can see what's going on. A little snippet of my day. It was a super awesome vlog, oh, wow. It was a super awesome fun vlog that I actually filmed with my sister and Dan Dal Chan, who's another YouTuber. So you can go check out that video and you can check out what we did and let's get right into the haul. So the first two things I got, I'm just gonna say two things, but although they're pretty much the same thing, is Pocky! Now you guys know I love a candy, I am a food addict, so the first thing I did was I hit up the candy aisle, Japanese candy style. I was gonna get like Kit Kats and all that, but I just did not get them because there was not enough time in the day to do everything I wanted to do. So the first thing I got is actually these Pocky and they're actually the banana and chocolate flavored and I had no idea this existed. I've seen multiple different flavors of Pocky and I've never once heard of the banana and chocolate, yet alone like actually tasted it. This is so good guys, this is so good. It tastes exactly like bananas and it smells of bananas. So highly recommend. The third thing I guess, or the second or third, whatever you want to call it, is I actually got two posters when I was there and because I don't actually have them physically with me because we already hung them up on, on my wall I'm gonna have like snippets because yesterday my sister asked me if she could hang them up on the wall and I was like yeah sure go for it hang them up and then it's I didn't realize that I actually had to film them in the hall so I don't have physical posters right now they're on the wall so you'll just have like a video attachment right here so the first poster I got was actually Harley Quinn and actually I love Harley with a personal respect. I think this is her Oracle Asylum outfit from that video game but um, even so, if, if it's not like her original cowl, she's like the cutest and like sexiest like DC villain on planet earth. Like I literally love her. She's been one of my uh, main cosplays that I want to do and I think I might do her maybe next year for Fan Expo. No, I'm doing Asuna for Fan Expo. If I do more than one day at Fan Expo, I think I'll do more than one cosplay, but I'm not sure. I've always wanted to do a cosplay of her. I love her look and she's my favorite, so I picked up a poster of her. The second poster is actually Sailor Moon, and I am a mega Sailor Moon Moony. So I had to get Sailor Moon. I guess my sister said she knew the girl had this because she follows her on DeviantArt. So she actually got the girl to sign all of her posters, and she like low-key was like, do you have your Sailor Moon poster? because it wasn't actually up on the billboards and the girl's like, I do, and she like pulls it out from underneath. And I was like, that like, like, you know you're a fan when, you know when you're a fan. The third thing slash fourth thing, we're just gonna call it the third thing now because I'm done figuring out what number we're at. The next thing I got is actually the Otaku mouse pads. Now I've seen these in other like hauls for like weeaboos or like nerd, like nerds or girls. 
there is actually a YouTuber called Neuterala, and I remember seeing she did one. I think she went to M MCM um, Expo in London, because she is a UK YouTuber, and she ended up getting one of these. I think it was a different character. I'm not sure which one she got, but um, she ended up getting a mouse pad. I've seen quite a lot on Instagram, so I was like not ashamed to pick up one of these, although I think the guy who actually sold it to me was. And the last thing I have, yes, I know this is like a really short haul, but the reason why it's really short is because I spent a majority of my cash that I was going to spend at Fan Expo on this one object. And you're probably thinking, then what the hell did you buy? I actually ended up buying a replica sword, and I'm going to pull her out right now. I'm not going to mention how much the sword cost because it was quite a bit of money, but it was worth it and actually it's kind of like, it's a reasonable price because it is full metal. Everything on here is full metal except for the gems and the actual casings wood. But even then everything's high quality, nothing's plastic or anything like that. So as you guys can see, this is the handle. But this is a replica sword of Lambient Light, which is Asuna's sword in Sword Art Online. Which is the same character I showed you that was on my otaku like mouse pad. And I'm obsessed with and told you that I was going to cosplay. So, yeah. For some reason, our fan expo day turned into like a Sword Art Online day. Everything related to Sword Art Online. And it was really, really weird. <laughs> we realized that at the end of the day. We were like, pretty much everything we bought and or talked about or like saw related to Sword Art Online in some way. It was the strangest, strangest thing. But yeah, that's everything I bought from Fan Expo. And I know you guys were probably like, oh, another haul. I'm so sad. But I'm really, really sick. And I've been sick all week. And I couldn't really do anything else. I can even like do a cover if I want to do a cover, like I can't do anything. <laughs> the only thing I thought of and I planned to do this week was the haul because I just didn't have the energy and or like the like the actual health to go outside and do like an outfits video for fall or something like that or even bother to do like a makeup tutorial, like I was, I was not having it. Let's pray for my health that I get better by next week and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you guys next Tuesday. Bye guys!